What's up guys, Bucks County Batman here. Today I'm gonna to be doing a full review on my Batman Beyond suit, muscle suit from uh, Napers FX. I'll be putting a full suit on everything for you so you guys can check it out. I'm back. So the muscle suit is made by Napers FX. You can find Napers FX on Instagram. There's also Napers Batman. So the chest, the chest symbol came from Tigerstone FX. The muscle suit itself is from Napers. I believe I paid like eighteen hundred for the muscle suit. He's upgraded it since then. It's about it's about two three years old now. Also got the uh, the arm spikes. They were also from Tigerstone FX on Instagram as well. Tigerstone. I don't think you can get this stuff from them anymore. I think he closed that temporarily. She closed down the shop. It's got the zipper in the back. I don't know why they didn't make the zipper black. I ripped it in my one of my videos last week. I patched it up a little bit here. <laughs> Something's in my ass. Mm. The suit's very comfortable. One of the most comfortable suits that I have. It's very flexible, very mobile. Take you into the workshop, show you the uh, the mask. This is the belt. This was made by Steve Riddick. Steve makes the best belts by far. No one's even close. So you can find him on Instagram as well. I'll link him below. Steve Riddick, really detailed. I wanted to add a little red light to the belt. Never just, never got around to doing it yet. Still have to add the wings to the suit as well. It's really the only thing missing. Got the gloves. They messed up on the gloves a little bit, but they sent me some extra material. I got the extra material, which I covered the uh, sneakers. Some people think he wears boots, but in the game, it's just, it's basically just all one piece, which connects with the suit. Then we got the cowl. There's the, uh, Batman Beyond cowl comes with the neck piece. The neck piece is very hard to put on. I could put the cowl on for you right now if you guys want to see. I do have LEDs for these eyes. Show you guys the LEDs and then I'll put the mask on for you. Okay guys, so these are the lights that go in the eyes. I'm gonna try to put it right up to the camera. It's a little bit hard to see out of, but you can see, you still can see. Turn it off. With the light on, it's a little bit brighter, but you could use a heat gun and you bend this and kind of mold it and tape it inside the mask. I didn't do that. I just kind of tape them in there without it. But there's the LED eyes. I think I paid like, I don't remember what I paid, maybe like 80 bucks for these. So I'm gonna try the mask on now for you guys. And then uh, afterwards I'll put the full suit on. All right, so we got the Batman Beyond mask. It's a little bit muffled, a little bit hard to hear out of it. Be right back. We'll try and show you how I put on the full suit. So we're back in the workshop, guys. I'm going to show you exactly how I put the Batman Beyond suit on and how I suit up with it. I could do most part, mo for the most part, I could do this myself. I have Dick Grayson behind me. He's going to help zip me up. So I get the legs in. Kind of work it up. All right, Grayson, zip me up. It didn't work. All right, leave it, just do the outside. Thanks, Pulse. Pulse plate just zipped me up. This is the full suit. We got the gloves, let's, uh, let me point the camera down a little bit. We'll get the rest of the legs on. I basically, I just have to adjust the, ch the chin guards. Make sure everything lines up. So we got the full suit. I already told you guys it was made by Napers FX on Instagram. The full muscle suit was around 1200. The symbol on the chest, I'm not sure what I paid for that. Maybe a hundred bucks. That was from Tigerstone FX. The fins on the arm, probably another hundred bucks. I glued them on. The only thing I'm missing is the wings. Uh, should have made the zipper black. We got the shoes. A lot of people say I should have boots on. I used to wear the Nike sneakers with this or maybe some slippers or something. He doesn't wear boots. He actually, if you look in the game, it just kind of blends in. So this is perfect. These are a pain in the ass to put on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put them on right now. Probably shouldn't have zipped the back of the suit, but um, this suit is pretty flexible. So I think I can get these on. I should have got a bigger size shoe. Got it. So we got that. Shoes are done, they blend in nicely. Just wear black socks, kind of tuck that in. I wasn't going to put the, uh... well, let's talk about this. 
So this is the mask. I think I paid like 450 for this neck piece. It's very difficult to put on. I'm gonna have to wet my hair. What I do is I get it really wet and then I just kind of slide it over my neck hair. We'll go upstairs and we'll do that. We got the mask. Mask with the neck piece from Tigerstone FX was around $450. Tigerstone doesn't make it anymore as far as I know. Uh, I'd have to get back to you on a few other people that could make you a similar mask. But I, I added the white eye mesh, which you can see pretty well out of that. I wanna show you the LED lights. There's a few videos where I use the LED lights. My LEDs are broken right now, but this is the lenses. These are the lenses. Once the, you could see through them, you see how you could see through them. You could use a heat gun and you could melt this and kind of form it and tape it inside of the mask. For right now, we're just gonna leave it how it is. It's broken, so I'm gonna temporarily hold this on here. But there we go. There's the lights on. Much harder to see when the lights are on. That's off. But anyway, you can fold, form these into the glass. Looks really cool. Might add them later. I added them for a video. We're gonna go upstairs and put the neck piece on, but before I do that, I love this suit. It's a little bit heavily muscular. Um, the reason that is, is because a lot of people don't realize Terry McGinnis stole this suit from Bruce. So when I wear the suit, I kind of consider myself, you know, old man Bruce Wayne inside of the Batman Beyond suit. Other than that, I love everything's perfect except for the material. I had uh, Napers were nice, nice enough to send me a little bit of extra material that I use for the shoes. I want to add this to the mask, but I don't want to ruin the mask since Tiger Stone's not making it anymore. If anybody can, can help me out with this, maybe form it onto the mask, that would be awesome. That way it would blend nicely with the suit. And last thing I want to show you is the belt. Belt also by Steve Reddick. You guys know I love Steve's belts. I wanted to add the red light to the belt. Haven't done it yet. A little bit of lights to the belt's always cool. But Steve Riddick on Instagram, love the belt. First, first cosplay suit I've ever had was actually Batman Beyond, guys. See some pictures of that on my Instagram, my original Batman Beyond suit. I have my son's Batman Beyond. I was actually gonna use this belt. That's my son's mask. That's his Batman Beyond suit. But we'll go upstairs. We'll put the neck piece on. We got everything on. Gloves, I don't like the way that the gloves turned out. He kind of rushed the gloves. Gotta have the gloves. Can't have the suit without the gloves. But uh, I started wearing these gloves and I think they look better. These work with my phone. They have the touchscreen fingers on them. I think they look good. Don't necessarily need the honeycomb. But we'll go upstairs, we'll wet it, we'll put the neck and we'll put the mask on. See what you guys think. Guys, I'm back, we're in the kitchen. I'm gonna show you how to put the mask on. I'm gonna wet the mask, kind of squeeze it over my head, put the gloves on, show you what the full suit, finished suit looks like. I usually do this in the shower, but Grayson's in the shower now, so we're gonna do it out here. Slid on pretty easily today. Then I have to kind of tuck the mask inside of it. Look over here, give you the full view. I'm not gonna put the gloves on. But there it is guys, full Batman Beyond suit. You winning Damien? Damien's playing Fortnite. I don't know how well you guys could hear me, but I put a picture up of uh, what my original Batman Beyond suit looks like compared to the upgraded one. Very flexible, very mobile. Work out in this suit. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. Click the bell button, make sure you subscribe, comment below for the algorithm. Until next time, Batman Beyond out.